everyone, welcome. So this is my Tackle the Feelings Before the Behavior Parenting Approach channel, or if you're watching it on Facebook. And I just wanted to introduce it to you and introduce myself to you if you haven't heard of what I've been doing at the moment. And it was all a work in progress, so this is the second introduction video, which I want to make a bit more concise and hopefully more clear so that you all understand what my videos that you'll see on my channel are all about and what I'm aiming to do. I think you might like it, so bear with me. So, a lot of you may have heard of the concept of emotional regulation. And this is an incredibly, incredibly important thing that we need to do with our children, especially in those early years, those formative years. And that's basically, in layman's terms, without the fancy schmancy wording, is about regulating or managing emotions, teaching your children about all the full range of emotions, and not only teaching them about the emotions, but teaching them how to recognize them in themselves, how to feel okay with feeling everything that they feel, and being exactly who they are when they need to be that, that way, and also to be able to respond to their emotions in appropriate ways so that they know how to manage that extreme anger or that frustration or fear or whatever comes up for them, that they have tools and resources to be able to cope with the, the not so easy emotions and to really embrace the good ones, the joy, the excitement. And so that they, uh, you've probably heard about the mind, body and spirit link. You know, it's all so connected. There's so much research going on about how connected our minds are to our bodies and to our spirit. And it's about teaching us to, to be true to ourselves. And this approach aims at preventing things like childhood emotional neglect. And this is different to emotional abuse and it's different to simple neglect that, you know, not being fed enough, not being bathed, not being looked after in a way. This is emotional neglect where we neglect to manage those emotions. We neglect to validate our children's feelings. And this is such a generational thing. It goes from generation to generation and it's these cycles that the most well-intending parents and our parents and grandparents and everyone, they love their children, they do the best they can. But they didn't know this. They didn't know about emotional regulation and they didn't know about attachment and how important attachment and that bond between the child and the primary caregivers is for healthy development. So now I'm taking that research and I'm aiming to make this free and accessible online for you. I'm making myself available so that you can ask questions or, or ask for topics. And I'm going to share with you what I've learned along my journey personally, but as a psychotherapist working in family support, working with vulnerable families with attachment trauma, working with people who are on the way end of the spectrum. So my aim is to help you manage your kids' emotions and give you those tools, give you that information and help you identify what behavior is going on for your child so that it's not just punishing children, but helping your children to get their needs met and behave in more appropriate ways so that there's less chaos in the home, that they don't feel low in self-esteem or self-confidence because they understand the difference between the behavior and who they are as people and what they experience and how they experience the world. You want your kids to be their own unique person. You want to be your own unique person. You want to have a nice balance in the home and you want your children to thrive. You want them to be happy. You want them to reach for the stars and reach their dreams and make the most out of their lives and enjoy everything that life has to offer. And to be able to cope with all the difficulties that life has to offer because life is tough. So it's setting your kids up with these skills and doing this early prevents problems that could arise later on. So my aim is to inform you, to give you information, to help you in, an, in like an approach so that giving you some strategies and tips and things to do and how to regulate those emotions and talking about it and making you aware of all these things. 
and so that you may, can take what you need and adapt it for your family. Because every family is different. And so I've got a master's degree in psychotherapy. I'm fully trained up. My approach is humanistic, which means I believe in every individual experience. I believe you are the expert in your own life. And I'm here to guide. I'm here to give you information. I'm here to provide those tough theories in ways that you can understand. And I'm here to support you. So I hope that's sounding good to you. And I've got an my Tackle the Feelings channel on YouTube and a Facebook page and I'm sharing some things on LinkedIn so and Twitter. So subscribe to my channel or like my Facebook page and take a watch of those videos and argue with me if you don't agree. But let's get the ball rolling and get some information out there on emotional regulation. Thanks for listening. I hope to see you again. Bye.